So Wula Vintage Park in Banipur district is abuzz right now with the mega event Koshur Fankar. <laughs> We have with us Angelina Fernandez uh, from Bombay. Uh, Angelina, tell us something about this event. Thank you, Nazir. It is an honor and a pleasure to be here at the world's Asia's largest natural freshwater park, a lake. Uh -huh. And we have our heart. We've been having our heart for folk music. We've had our heart for Kashmir for the longest time. And we got this opportunity. We grabbed it with both hands. And it is such an honor, a pleasure to be here in Bandipura, to be able to hear the music, to be able to promote the music. And we want to take it forward as far as we can. Thank you, you, you have been uh, you have been into the industry for a quite long time. You That's have been correct. creating music, uh, you know, festivals, music events, uh, not just in uh, Delhi but in Bombay, in the rest of the states of India. And uh, this is your first time in Kashmir. This is my first time. And in Kashmir. you are mostly dealing with the folk artists. We are dealing a lot with folk artists. Uh, what yes. is the what is the overall response from the folk artists? Uh, they are very excited. They are very happy. Mm -hmm. They want. They are just so keen to come out because the folk music is so pure. It's so raw, uh -huh. and it has been tampered with so much. Uh -huh. So our dream and our desire is to take it forward as it is. Uh -huh. We don't want to mess with it. We want it to go forward so it doesn't die because we've got such a rich tradition. Uh -huh. And Kashmir, the, my first trip here, Kashmir is amazing. The music is amazing. And you are wearing and something Kashmiri. I had to. I actually bought this this morning uh -huh. only to wear this for the thing. Okay. I bought and had another outfit with me, uh -huh. but I bought this to wear today. This is so beautiful. And uh, what is the overall, uh, you know, uh, roadmap for the event? What? Uh, how, how are you identifying the artists? Who are going to perform in, in this event? So we had an entire procedure that they had to go through. Mm -hmm. They had to submit their mm -hmm. uh, registrations over a period of time. Mm -hmm. There was an elimination process that took place. And we've come down to five finalists. Uh -huh. So we had a jury. We had a couple of people who've sat, who've been in the music industry, especially with folk music, for a long period of time. Mm -hmm. And accordingly, there were eliminations. And finally, we're down to five who are going to be pre uh, presenting their music today uh -huh. in two rounds. Uh -huh. One a song of their own choice. Second, they've been asked to prepare a song, but should the judges ask them uh -huh. to do something specific, uh -huh. they need to be able to do that as well. And then the winner gets to perform with Nur Mohammed Sahib at the end. Okay. So would you be able to also identify artists and take them you know, to different states to perform and all? That is the intention and that is the purpose. So God willing, mm. we'll be able to do that as well. So what is the takeover from Kashmir? I'm definitely so coming back. I am coming back. <laughs> I want to come back. I was just talking to some of them saying, we don't. I don't want to do this once a year. If not, this, this may be once a year. We definitely want to do a lot more with the folk artists. And what is your message for the industry people who, who are doing a lot of in, you know, events back in Delhi, Bombay, elsewhere. They have to come and listen to this. This is the rawness, the music, the beauty. Uh -huh. It is breathtaking. It's stunning. It's breathtaking. I've sent home so many pictures to the family, to, to other people. Everyone is absolutely stunned. They're amazed. Thank you so thank, much. Thank you for having us here. Thank you. Thank, thank you for this. There's a team that has come all the way from Delhi, Bombay to organize this Kosher Fankar event at this majestic Wooler uh, viewpoint. We have with us Nani Singh from Delhi. 
and uh, many showcase events has been doing a lot of events uh, nationally globally rather and how important is this event for you thank you so much nazir for this opportunity and uh, this is very important for us and very important for us particularly because our heart beats for uh, folk music and we wanted an opportunity to come and showcase the kashmiri folk music we felt that this was this was just not getting as much attention as it deserved the mm -hmm. folk instruments your the music the singing everything else put together so we were looking for an opportunity and uh, god brought that our way why to why, why to why to help this event in bandipura uh, you know all the way away from uh, summer capital srinagar so very interesting thing which i discovered was that bandipura is the music capital of kashmir and the biggest poets have come out of here the music has come out of here and then we've got the beautiful wulur lake which is the sec which is the largest freshwater lake in asia mm -hmm. so why not in bandipura mm -hmm. why everything in srinagar or pehelgam on gulmarg there's so much more to kashmir why not discover our kashmir and there's so much talent which people don't even know about so that was really the whole so idea. at a time when we are actually uh, witnessing a uh, lot of uh, folk genres are actually fading away and then you have a very important genre called sufiana music of kashmir it's also uh, on the on the on the last leg of its you know uh, this uh, progress so what would be the overall focus of you know event companies like you to organize or to rope in these kind of stakeholders or artists so our major purpose was to bring in the youth of kashmir here mm -hmm. because that was the whole idea of koshur kunkar like mm -hmm. the talent hunt and why were we doing this we said the youth is the torch bearer of our future right if we don't we mm. are the ones who have to advise the youth if we don't tell them this if we don't tell them that you know how important is your own culture your folk music your sufiana music imbibe karo mm -hmm. don't you don't have to run through towards bollywood or modernize modernize this music modernize mm. this sound so that everybody sings it mm. so we felt this was the best opportunity to bring in the youth of kashmir give them a platform to present their talent and then parallelly bring out the folk music of kashmir so in this particular today's contest contest is very clear it is either kashmiri folk music or kashmiri sufiana music only these two so if you don't sing either of these you are disqualified what are the what is the take away from kashmir take take away that i'm going to come back very very soon uh -huh. i love the place i love the people i love the talent i love the music more than anything else and we're going to be back here very soon thank you so much and we wish you all the best thank you thank you, thank you so much Thank you.